Movies that he done? Yeah, I did. Um, you did. I got the hookup too, right? Yeah, I did. I got the hookup too with Master, Master P. P. It was a whole bunch of people on that bitch. Yeah. <laughs> the thing I, I always wanted to ask you about Master P because okay. people saying about his business, like he do bad business, and I never know. Growing up under, you know, watching Cash Money, you know, No Limit, right? You would never think that Master P was that guy. Okay, when Master P is right. This is my thing with Master P, bro. He talk a good game. And sometimes to me, like as a grown man, it's nothing wrong with him like making mistakes and shit like that. He talk a good game, but sometimes he don't walk it. That's how I feel. Right. That's how I feel with Master P. Like he cool dude. He gave me an opportunity of a lifetime to put me in my first box office movie, whatever the case may be. And I appreciate it from giving him a role. But it's like sometimes you, 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 you talk it, but you don't walk it. You know what I'm saying? Like at the end of the day, you feel me? I ain't talked to Master P since 2019. Damn. And, it, and it's like, damn, we like when I was on set, it was like, this is my OG. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, fat boy, listen. Duh, 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 duh. Right. I ain't talked to you since 2019. What type of shit is like, you know what I'm saying? What, what's Where's going your on? honor at? What, yeah. what, what's going on? Like, and I ain't saying I reached out because I do my own thing. I get my own money. I pay my mortgage. I gotta pay my own cars. I don't right. need no handout from nobody. I don't care if you got a billion dollars. I don't need shit from you. But it's just like the the camaraderie of this situation. When we was on set, when you was using me, it was all like, you know what I'm saying? Like, right. yeah, fat boy, da, 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 da. But now it's like the movie done, everything up, it's over. You know what I'm saying? Just like with like if I do so, if I if I never I never in my life if that, somebody did a, if I did a move with you I I keep in touch or keep you know what I mean like that right. camaraderie going it's just like damn man, you get used in this industry sometimes to me that's how I feel for the but numbers. did he keep the business like the business part that was straight right yeah now nah, the business part definitely wasn't straight it was cool you know what I'm saying it wasn't straight though I got my money you know what I'm saying but I didn't get all my money you feel what I'm saying right. shit is still owed to me facts like it's on it's on lawyer like my lawyer I don't talk about this shit because it don't mean that to me because I get my shit off the muscle, but at the end of the day, there's money owed to me with that shit. Like, I seen Jess Alaria say that shit. I seen a couple, uh, it's really money owed to me. My lawyer, bro, my lawyer, Bob Celestin, Alicia, they will tell you, my nigga, like, no cap. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't bullshitting. I'm not trying to cap. I'm not trying to do this shit for no views. None of that shit. I don't need the money. Keep it. But I'm just saying it's owed to me. It's right. money owed to me. Give me what's me. mine. Right. It's owed to me, though. You can keep it. I don't want it, but right. it's money owed to me. My lawyer, my this shit is on documents. I will show you the documents. I it's on paper. I call my lawyer right now. He'll tell you. It's on documented. Right. It's documented. Deep, it's documented. Hold I on. owe you. Hold it's on. Let crazy. me let me get my let me get my uh hold on. Hold I gotta on. make sure y'all tune in, man, because you know, fat boy gonna give you the facts. He ain't gonna he ain't gonna drag you through the mud, tell you a bunch of lies and um Right now, he, he's speaking the pure Savannah. That's it. That's respect that. Sunday, we, it's a Sunday is they family. Yeah, day. Sunday is probably family yeah. day. You know how I go with the. But Lord. your word gold, you said it. I know it's honor. You know what I'm saying, and I, yeah. and I don't want it. Keep it. But it's just like, damn, like, come on, where's the, like you said, the honor and shit like that? Like, you took care of us when we was on set. You did this, but it's like, it's business at the end of the day. We got family just like you. We got we got people just like you. It's like, that's what they, that's what these, that's what industry motherfuckers do sometimes. They think because they made, they die, like, like, fuck them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, like hell no, I'm gonna get my shit off the mud. I don't need nobody. The look I don't was need good you. enough. The look was good enough. That shit, I don't need you. And I tell everybody this, I don't need you. But if we come together, we're gonna make something special. Let's come together. We're going to make something. But I don't need you. You don't need me. That's how That's how it go, you know, at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? But it's like when Master P was just like, you know, a a, a, a take, take situation. Right. A give, give you this. I'm going to take this and fuck you. That's right. how I feel. You know exactly. what I'm saying? And I, I got the all the right to feel like that. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing against nobody. Like, I love Master P. He a cool dude. He took care of us when we was on set. Cool. But at the end of the day, business is business. Handle business the way you want business to be handled for you. Bottom line. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Because line. they they want their business constructed, right? Why we why cause we cause I'm on Instagram. I can't have my business. I can't have my business right. You know what I'm saying? Like I got into an argument. Rest in peace, AJ Johnson. Me and AJ Johnson, I didn't like him. Me and him was not cool. You know, the Ezel dude. Right. I did not like him. I did not like him on the I did not like him on the mm, set. You know what I'm saying? It all. On, on the um on, on the mat, on the movie set, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cause he tried to he tried to minimize and downplay my downplay me as a as a person as a man, you know what I'm saying? Right, like, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like you ain't no actor, you just a you just a fat Instagrammer. Some shit he used to say, and I was like, nigga, you you just Ezel. 
Like, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, God rest his soul, you feel what I'm saying? I wish we had time to mend the fence, but I didn't talk to him after that. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you feel me? It was right. just like, that's how they treat you. They, that's how they want to treat you. But I stood, my, I stood on my toes. I ain't going to let nobody play me. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to stand on my toes. I'm going to be something great. You know what I mean? That's what I told him. I'm going to be something great. I'm me. I ain't going to change for you. Just because you saying that ain't going to make me no bit of difference. I'm always going to win. Simple as that. That transition. How was that transition like from that lifestyle of just being bare minimum to going for the highest? Like, Because a lot of people don't understand. You could have stayed at one point. Yeah. He could have stayed just like doing like, like you said, one thing at one yeah. time and trying this. But how... You know, how's that transition to be able to do all these tasks at one time, having a family and everything? How was that, man? I'm a multitask. I'm a boss. I'm a hustler. I'm a go-getter. I Like, if I got to put on that shirt of carrying the bags, I'm going to put on the shirt to carry the bags. It, it, uh, 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 a boss, he makes sure, he makes he he covers everything. If I got to, I clean the house. My wife don't clean up. She don't clean the house. Mm, I clean deep. the house. I mop the floor. I wash the dish. I make sure the house clean me. You take care of the bills, you do all that 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 mindful shit that you gotta use your brain for. All I right. use my brain, don't get me wrong, but I fuck around tell a uh, tell a cable people, look, I'm gonna pay right. you in two months, I'm paying you in two That's weeks. That's me. You know what I'm saying? That's Hold me. on. Let me get, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna That's give you me this. here. That's, That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna the give woman you. would have to pay yeah, it. Yeah, right? they gotta pay it. That's why we don't got a woman, I don't pay my bill. That's what I'm saying. So I'm like, look, I me with the bill, man. I try to pay a partial. Look, I got 200 for you. I'm trying to keep my little 800 you know what I'm saying? I got you, I'm gonna pay you. That's what I, I mean, that's what we all do. That's what men do because we hate paying bills. But at the end of the day, I clean it up. If I got to put the shirt on to do anything with my business, I'm going to do it. So let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. You know what I mean? I got to ask you this question. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about the Troy Ave situation, him finally getting in that box? Me with that, you know what I'm saying? Come from the streets, I would have never took the stand on nothing. I don't know nothing. I don't. I don't care about no. I don't. It, it, it's pride. It's pr like you know. Sometimes uh, as men, we deal with a lot of pride. Sometimes you're not supposed to deal with pride, but certain situations you do. I'm not getting on no stand and and talking about nothing. It don't matter. I don't care. It's bro. It's in my soul. God know the score. Jesus know the score. I would never get on no stand in my life to say nothing about nobody. Nobody. No, I'm not get. I don't care. I don't care what it is. I don't care if they say hello. I'm not getting on no stand in front of witnesses, jurors, all that shit. No, I'm not getting on no stand. So, but I feel about that situation. He should have never got in that box. He should have never got in that, that 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 testifying box. You know what I'm saying? Come from the streets, you gonna testify? What they gonna call you? A rat? And what and what can you what can you say? I'm you. I don't know. I, I think Troy Harris should never did that. That was a dumb move. That was dumb. I think at that point he probably just gave up music. How you feel about that? You think he just said, nah, I'm off the rap tip now? Because you know, that's kind of a hard thing to do. Yeah, once you get on the stand. I think that I never this is why I don't go out. Because I don't care where the club's at. It's in somebody's neighborhood. And it's like, why are so many people able to get their guns in the club? I'm never that's why I never feel safe. But it wasn't you know no saying? club. That shit was Urban Plaza. I was there that night in 2016. I was it wasn't there. In the club. It wasn't in the What's club. Urban Plaza? That's like a. It was like it's like a. a um, it's in New York. It's like a show. It's like a uh, a show theater. Yeah, like a theater. I was there that night when they start letting off the shots. We running. We running down the street. You know what I'm saying? I was there. Like I was there that night because I was going to link up. I think with Ti. Yeah, I was going to link up with Ti and shit like that. So you feel me? Like I was there that night. Like I was really there. Like you know what I'm saying? Like. Feel me? So it's like, damn. I think I was going to link up with T.I. and Hovain. Rest, uh, God rest Hovain, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? That was Trey Ave manager before anything, you know what I mean? Like, so, okay. and, and uh, Hovain got me a couple bags before he passed away, you know what I'm saying? He just recently passed away. Shout out to Hovain and shit, but I was dead, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? I seen the mask of that shit, you feel me? So at the end of the day, I still want to took the stand. You got hit. I, why would you take the stand? You got hit. You know everything, and you t like. I mean, it's on camera, but at the end of the day, you still told it. You still told. You still put it on record. You still put it in a statement. They know if, if they know everything. I ain't saying nothing. Just give me my case money. Give me what you owe me from Urban Plaza. I'm gonna sue Urban Plaza. I need that money. Let's get a lawyer for that. I want to sue them. I got engine in y'all building. Give me uh two hundred and fifty million. We cool. You know what I'm saying? Give me 10 million. We'll yeah, get me out of the way, huh? Get me out the way. You give me 10 million, we settle at Urban Plaza. I love you. I come back do three shows. Just give me 10 million. I'm hitting mm -hmm. y'all building. It wasn't no safety guidelines. That's what I would have did. That's it. 
You know what I'm saying? Now, they probably was talking to him about Tom and everything. At the end of the day, they see it on camera. I'm the I'm the one being attacked. So hey, what y'all whatever y'all want to do, do it. It's on camera. Right. I'm not I'm not going in there talking though. That's what? The, if it's on camera, it's for on what? camera. What I'm talking about? It was on camera. Everybody seen about. that that massacre and that shit that happened. We synced it. It's just that I don't think they know who got killed, who shot, whatever. Like through the yeah, camera, they don't but know you the see, whole thing. you you see, you see what happened on the camera. So it looked like Troy was being attacked. Case case may case may be whatever the case may be. So at the end of the day, why would you still go back and tell it? Why would you allegedly. put in a statement? Yeah, allegedly because this is what he says. He says that he see him and his security guard. This is from the Rizat's mouth. He says that him and his bodyguard see Taxone. And Taxone put out his hand and said, what's popping? And we all know. What popping could be just what it is. What's, what's popping? What's up? What's up? How are you doing? What's up? How yeah. many times you had people had in, like incidents online, right? Where they see each other and it, it don't even be that. It'd be like, damn, what's up, man? And they be cool. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, him look at his, he said his bodyguard said, I'm going to rock him. He said that about Tax Tone. I'm going to rock Troy him. Said. That's what Troy Why Ave said. Why would he say that? This is a Troy so Ave statement. you allowing a security guard, someone who's in charge of your life, to say he's going to rock somebody? We all know what rock could mean from any type of urban community. Hmm. So at the end of the day, you just actually sick your guard on him to harm him. And he defended himself. It's in defense of his own life. So and why would your security guard say that? Your security guard is supposed to be there to defuse situations and help situations, not 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 provoke situations and want to harm somebody. You there to guard your life. Y'all there to do a job, go pull up on Ti because it was it was for Ti show, and I guess it was there to bring him out and shit like that. Whatever right. it means. Your security guard is there supposed to defuse situations. He got to attack when the attack is happening, of course. Exactly. But he's there to defuse. Why would your bodyguard say I'm going to rock him? And he can't speak about it now. He can't talk about it now. So now I don't know. I don't believe you. Yeah, and now you're just putting anything in the atmosphere. You're the only one with the story, but everybody getting the story from you. No, because what it was, what it was, here it go. Tax probably came up there tough, like coming up there. What's popping, nigga? Like, what's up? Yeah. He probably, his body got warm. Body got warmed up. He got, oh, shit. It like, heart <laughs> beat, adrenaline rushing. Kidding me, about to get us. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? So he like, yo... You know what I'm saying? Boom, be on alert, hit him. Like, whatever the case may be. So that's how I felt it happened. Because nobody gonna come in with pop and then your security, I'm gonna rock him. Well, how that, that that don't even sound right. I'm taking my security, what's that dumb ass talking about? I'm leaving, man. You yeah, yeah, we can't even, I, you can't protect you, 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 you can't, me. His job is to rock. get you home. Yeah, that's your get you main home. goal. I'm also going to say that. I, like, you're not worrying about getting me home after you just kill somebody. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And then, and then you're you, about getting yourself you, out of here. Who's going to get me told, home now? And then he told, then he said, that he allegedly said that his security told him that he's going to rock him. Why would your security go? He ain't suitable to be as no security and guard. And he told him, go ahead, or some shit like that. Go ahead. He said, do your thing and do wait that. Do your thing. What you don't? That's stupid. Then that's he, just dumb. You're a fool. Then, and now, this I don't is what, know. This that's is, dumb. This is from Troy Ave's. That's just testimony. Dumb. That's testimony. Just dumb. This is his that's testimony. He shouldn't have been an artist then. If I if I if I look at it like that, he shouldn't have been an artist because it's your job to make it home to your kids. It's your job to do a job, leave. No matter what y'all got going on, y'all could have rumbled it out, whatever the case may be. Or if it was that deep, I'd have just left. I'd have been like, such and such, let's go, man. Cause you talking dumb. You talking about you about to rock him and shit like that. You talking stupid. And this spicy. ain't the right time. This ain't the right time. We in somebody building. We're about the wrong do. shit. Let me get out of here. Yeah, you right, worrying about the wrong shit. And tax, look, not today. Move, move, watch out. We yeah, gotta please, go. we gotta go. Yeah, we, <laughs> we gotta get away from it. And, and youngins, y'all gotta, y'all gotta take heed to that. He young, but his mindset isn't yeah. to be stupid. You see what I'm saying? Y'all have to stop allowing individuals around y'all that are stupid. Um, you see him. You know something is going on that you can defuse the situation. We do that. Do that. You know, do that if you can. Make sure you can do it with your hands too. Because guess what? If you go too far and you intend to go way too far and you end up in a bad place, you might only have these. That's again. what I'm saying. Cause you gotta understand <laughs> it's, these, gonna, it's these, all gonna lead back to your hands. You gotta understand these some of these dumbass niggas in this world try to they provoke you to crash out. 
They provoke you to crash out. I crash out about my kids. I crash out about yeah, my family. Oh yeah, cra- oh, I'm yeah. going to do that. That's, around, that ain't nothing. But you, but these fools out here ain't going to trick me on my spot over nothing. Over you can nothing. say what you want. You ain't going to trick me on my spot of knowing I want to do. You ain't going to trick me to rat. You ain't going to trick me to do none of that dumb shit that you want me to do to knock me out my spots for me to be up the road crying because I want to be with my kids. That's how some of these niggas think. Either, either, it's, either it's jail or dead. Now I'm up the road crying and shit like that, and you niggas ain't even these the, the niggas don't even care. Nobody even you know what I'm saying. I'm that's, lost. That's in this one soul. of the reasons that I stopped wearing jewelry because it's like they will make you kill them for something that's yours. It's like why I gotta do something why I gotta to you do that? for my something shit. that's mine. This is mine. My, my I worked shit. hard. And I paid I, for this. This is me. You're trying to come what? and take it from me. I'm not going to let you do that. So now I got to do. I got to kill you. Say my kids, all of them. But that's what I'm saying. It's these dummies out here. Something who, that's mine. It's, it's these. It's these idiots out this bitch, bro. That don't give a fuck about nothing, bro. And they they could be get, these dumbass niggas could be getting money. They could be getting money, and they still stupid. For I had clout, a nigga bro. tell me. They do it for I clout. had a nigga tell me. I'm in two of and I had a nigga tell me. I crash out. Da, da, da. Nigga gotta be like 32, 33. I'm like, bro, you a fool. You an idiot. I cannot be, I cannot go, I can't go with you. Because at the end of the day, you got records on your phone. Right. You got you got shit on your phone and me talking to you. Something happened to you, they coming back to me. You saving messages, you saving voice audios, you saving pictures. Yeah, everything. Like that. Your whole I life. Can't, bro, I can't That's get a, in tune with you, bro. You're gonna I'm get afraid me locked of that. up. Like, you're gonna get me locked up. There's nothing I can do. When if I if 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 me and the nigga into and we texting and shit like that, or whatever the case may be, whatever the case may be, I'm deleting that shit. I don't want it in my phone. I don't want to yeah. see it. You keeping this shit. So if the DA gets your phone or something, something happened to you, you disappear on the face of the earth, they get your phone, are they coming to me first? I might not dot all my T's and That's all my I's. That's damn near dying declaration right there. I, I, I might not dot all my I's in, in the movement. Now I'm caught up. That now I'm in jail the rest that's, of my life. And that's just as him. good as them saying he killed me. That's the dying declaration. You Come left on. it there. And you didn't even kill him. You left it there for and a reason. And then you know how many niggas in this world, you do something to they sue you. You'll be like, bro, I thought you was tough. I thought we was into it for real. We ain't yeah. even into it. So them guys, I leave them alone. If they going to talk, let them talk. I ain't got time to be, y'all saving messages, y'all doing this weird shit. I'm right. not beefing with you. I can't beef with you. Shit out your day I can't all day. beef with you because I come from a world we ain't doing that. If it's up, it's up. If I see you, I see you, it's up. I'm not saving messages. I'm not sending you nothing back. I'm not sending you people laying down on the ground dead and shit like oh, yeah, that. That's, 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 that's right. rat. Yeah. That's a rat. It if it's like... into, it's into. I'm telling you, suck my dick, keep it moving. Let's get suck to my it. dick. Let's rip. That's it. Yeah. I'm not telling you, yo, when I catch you, I'm gonna do this to and you. And that statement alone that's should it. get you to be able to fight that's right it. away. That's all I that, that's at it. At this point, I just try to not to put myself in no position where it I will have to take it there. Yeah. For me to have to take it's it the only there. Piece you gonna have. I don't be around people too much, so I don't see myself ever. It had to be some karma, which I ain't gonna be able to duck anyway. So me neither. I, right. as far as new stuff, like something new happening and then I gotta kill somebody. Yeah. yeah I just don't see it. Yeah, no that's me too. Me neither. That's why I be like, I mean, alone. unless unless I start wearing jewelry again and I'm somewhere and somebody yeah. feel like my jewelry is worth them dying. I leave I leave I leave I leave certain niggas, I leave that shit alone. I just let them talk. Go ahead, talk. Do what y'all do. This when you see me, if it's up, it's up. Let me know. Let 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 it be known. Don't sleepwalk me and and I like you know what I'm saying because that's when I that's when I that's when I feel I don't feel safe. Dude. Right now I gotta go. All now I gotta the way. go automatically. I gotta walk around heavy. I gotta be heavy. You Everywhere. know what I'm saying? Shit like that. I got to. You know what I'm saying? Because my life is important. I got people to depend on me. These niggas ain't got nobody to depend on them. They go up the road. They don't care. They gonna be up the road and they sell. Yo, make me some chi chis. Make a me boat this. And no paddle. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. You know what I'm saying? They be they gonna be getting their money from their grandmother. They old bitch. This that. They're happy. That's why there's no way that somebody down there can beef with me because we we don't even talk, we don't speak, I don't even talk to you. Right. I don't even we don't I don't be we don't be in the same places. Nothing. Yeah, you know I'm saying there's no reason Nothing. why you will never be in the bank. None with me. of you, you will never be in. I don't, see, be I, don't, with I don't see none of you niggas in the airport. 
I don't see niggas in the airport. I don't see niggas at fucking the bank. <laughs> the bank. None of that shit. So it's like, it's pointless. Like, I move around. I go anywhere I want. I'm not Just scared of angry, nothing. Man. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, I don't put nothing past no, no man, but I'm not scared of not go anywhere I want. A nigga won't never tell me, don't come here. I'm coming. I will come. If it's not set up for me to get no money out there, I'm not coming. But if, I, if I'm getting money, I'm coming. I'm going to come. N nobody ain't going to silence me and tell me don't come nowhere because I, I do that shit tapping. That's what I do. Yeah. If I know somebody that I'm going to tap, if I'm coming to Philly, Leek, where you at? You know what I'm Let's saying? Tap. Like, you don't even have to bring no guns out just to know we got that. We got the understanding that I'm here. I'm I'm in North Philly. I'm at this club. Right. You don't got to come out because I don't want to risk your freedom. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm just letting you know I'm here just in case. You know what I'm saying? Because if you, I do it myself. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't want to never put nobody in jeopardy. But at the end of the day, these young niggas don't think like that. They just think. No, they don't have honor. It, these old niggas, some, some older niggas too don't think. You know what I'm saying? Because they don't got nothing to lose. I have everything to lose. I got people that really depend on me. So at the end of the day, these niggas ain't got nothing to lose. Hey, man. From what I'm seeing here, you won't lose. How that song go? I, I can't lose, I can't lose. 150 doves, 10. No, I, I can't choose. choose. You see yeah. what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, we it was an honor, man. Shout out OG Homie on that one from Violet, New Jersey, LA. Honorable nigga. OG Homie. He killed it too. Yep. You got an album coming out, you right? Know what I mean? Yeah, I got an album coming out. It's called The Biggest Heart. It's coming soon. I'm, I want to drop it on my grandmother's birthday, April 12th, or I might drop it on my other grandmother's birthday, April, 20, April 27th. You know what I'm saying? But it's definitely coming out April. The, the the latest early May. Early May for sure. But it's done. It's just getting the legal side done. You know how that shit go clearing shit, getting samples and shit clear. So it's getting worked up in the process right now. But at the end of the day, the album is come, coming. It's done. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready to, I'm, I'm ready to uh, get us to Empire. You know what I'm saying? Then do my thug this one. How, how hands-on are you with the uh, non-profits? Uh, my non-prop, I'm hands-on because I do I do a turkey drive every year. I do a, a toy drive every year. I partner up with Raymond Tires in Newark, New Jersey. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my guy Juan. I partner up with them and we do we do heavy things for the kids. You know what I'm saying? I wanna uh, this summer with my with my guy White Mike, he from Irvington, New Jersey. You know what I'm saying? My guy White Mike, he from Irvington, New Jersey. We I'm doing a basketball team with him this summer. You know what I'm saying? He got his own league. He helped the youth and things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? White Mike, I don't know if you know him. He did the crate challenge and shit like that. He fell out. He like he completed the crate challenge. That's my guy White Mike. He went viral on that one. Shout out to my dog. You know what I'm saying? So it's a blessing just to have a, a nonprofit organization. My nonprofit organization is called, it's called um Make the world smile. And I've been having it for a very long time. You know what I'm saying? I'm starting the dot org soon. And I just want to help like kids that's in foster homes. I want to help the homeless. I want to build like fat boy kids around every part of the world. Just to like you know, like you know, when you have homeless people and they homeless, I you know what I'm saying? They're gonna do drugs and all that shit if they want to. That's on them. But I wanna have a safe haven for them to come so they know they got I'ma order like a thousand t shirts, shit like that. thousand white t shirts so you can have something clean, you have three meals a day, shit like that. But it's gonna be like a fat boy cares, you know what I'm saying? You can take a shower, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna have dittos to teach you shit, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna show you how to build whatever. We're gonna show you how to start a business. I want shit like that in my in my facility when I start creating it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm gonna do the first one in Jersey soon, you know, get a small house or whatever and just build, do it like that. They come through, they don't have to pay no money and just, you know, take a shower, get warm clothes, you know, get some get some tea in their system, whatever the case is, something healthy, ginger shots, and just know that, you know what I'm saying, you got somebody here that care for you. You know what I'm saying? Because in the in this cold world, it's like a lot of people is here that don't care about you. And you know, I, I just want to show the world that I care. You know what I'm saying? To, to if it's one person, three people, I just want to show them I care. That's an honor, man. You ain't gonna hear that honor from nowhere else, man. And shout out to Jersey City, shout out to Irvington, man. Y'all got a star on y'all hands, not more than that. I'm hoping that, you know, this honor and this relationship that we're building Thank you. Thank you, can King. go a lot further, man. No, I definitely will. Definitely will, I look man. up to you, man. You no, know, I look a lot up to you, people, too. Appreciate you. A lot of people look for the for the younger guys to have to look up to the older guys. But when you, when guys like yourself pave the way and show us older guys yeah. how to feed our family, we got to say, no, I, I honor you. it. I no. take my glasses off. No, I appreciate you. I respect it because it's an appropriate. opportunity and appreciate you. it's based off of honor. And I respect how you... Are a man and doing taking care of your responsibilities. Thank you, stable, appreciate man. Thank you, appreciate, I appreciate that. I appreciate you. I mean, appreciate the whole podcast, the whole circle, of honor, the, Moss, whole circle you know? the whole circle of honor. You know what I'm saying, y'all, and y'all podcast is special because it's wrapped around honor, and that's all we got. If you if you be dishonorable, you know what I'm saying, it's death before dishonor. 
You know what I'm saying? So if you ain't honorable, what's next? It's death before dishonor. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm about to get that tatted on my skin. I never got it tatted, and I always wanted to tat it. If you right. if you catch what I just said, I never got it tatted, but I always wanted to tat it. No doubt. So I'm gonna get that, I'm gonna get that tatted because of circle of honor, you know what I'm saying? No cap. Because that, it's bro. death before dishonor. If you ain't honorable, it's nothing I can do with you. It's nothing I can do with you. Nothing. I think I think to me, have, loyalty and honor is the same thing. Honor is the action to loyalty. Yes. So if you don't honor nothing, if you don't, because it's like this, right? You know, when we, when I was growing up, it's people I answer to. It's like, it's still people I answer to. I answer to people like you. I answer to King Erna because if I do something out of pocket that you see on the internet, you're going to let me know, fat boy, I don't like what you did. I'm not going to. And it, it, behind the scenes, King Erna did something for me that motherfuckers want to dig. And I'm not going to speak on it, but you know what I'm talking about. And I right. salute you for that. And, I, and I appreciate you for that. Going through what I, going through life is going to have the ups and, ups and downs. You could have flipped it and did something else with it, but you right. didn't. You held the honor for me as a man, and I appreciate you for that. And it's something he did that's special. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to say it. He know what I'm talking about. I honor this man forever. He got my loyalty. He come to my house and sleep on my fucking couch, wherever. He go in my refrigerator. He's it's special. You know what I'm saying? Because he did something for me that nobody did. You know what I'm saying? That nobody would do and nobody would say. And King and Queen Flip called me and told me this. He called me in fact, I got something important to tell you. I said, What? He called me and told me King Erna did something for you that I don't think nobody would do. That nobody would have did with his platform. He would have just spoke on it. Right. No, King uh, Erna. Honor and tech, he, yeah. he, he he honored, he honored me as a man, as my relationship, as my life and shit. And I appreciate him for that. So King Erna, your honorable dude, Lee Moss. I appreciate you, bro. You're a dope artist. You know what I'm saying? Keep winning. Keep being blessed. You know what I'm saying? It's a matter of time. Free AR app. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the whole Philadelphia. But so the people, before we go, the people could be expecting a fat boy and Leek Moss track. Yeah, hell yeah. Of course. Uh, honorable Absolutely. Bo- of course. These, these the, like, I ain't going to lie to you. I don't like Moss to tell you. I don't like a lot of people's music. I listen to his music and I always appreciate listen it. to Moss music. Appreciate so you. hopefully, you know, everybody make sure y'all tune in. Y'all know who Fat Boy is. Appreciate it. He don't really need an introduction, but for the, the ones who don't remember, make sure y'all go follow him because a lot of y'all didn't unfollow and need to come follow back anyway. Yeah, facts. Live and, 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 and I'm right. mad. And I'm mad that Instagram took my nigga King on the page, man. Yeah, you know he was took... bucking that shit up, but you know he a hustler. He just keep getting that shit back up, man. Yeah, I'm on I'm earning. Facts. You hear me? Ernest, OBH, free the men. Mm-hmm. <laughs>